Hi, Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. So a couple of days ago, I posted a video that Google Chrome's live captions will soon have an option to hide profanity. Now, I'll leave that video down below, but a quick recap. And this was according to a new patch in Garrett. Uh, that's the Chromium Garrett, where Chrome's live captions will have an option to filter out profanity, similar to Windows 11's live captions feature. Now, I'm not going to get too much into the live captions, what they're all about in this video. I did cover that in the previous video, so go check that out. It's down below in the description. But just to let you know now that this is becoming more of a reality, and the option to filter profanity has now been added in Chrome Canary version 117, which is the latest preview version. So it's not an experimental feature. It's not hidden behind any flags. It's now a default feature in Chrome 117. So to get to the new live captions uh, to filter out profanity feature, we head to our settings. And for this, we'll have to head over to our accessibility page. And yeah, live caption, toggle that on and you'll see now hard profanity, which is toggled off by default. And if you turn that on now, that'll obviously give you the option now to filter any profanity out of those live captions, which as I did mention in that previous video, um, is a nice move in the right direction, as I always do say when I am uh, interested or think features are of benefit when they do and would roll out. So um, this is becoming a reality now. It's still early days, obviously. It's only in Chrome Canary, not available as yet in the stable version. Uh, but this is a good indication, especially now, that it's not behind an experimental flag. It's actually made its way now as a default feature, where as previously posted, it was just a patch over... Um, in the Chromium Garrett, and now it's become a feature. So this is a very good indication, and I do personally think that Google will roll out this option to filter out any profanity in the live captions in the stable version. And um, when that does become available, I will post and keep you guys updated and in the loop. So thanks for watching, and I will see you in the next one.